Nagbabalik po ang pabansang almusal. Kahapon, nag-share si Michelle Lazaro na ilang etiquette sa virtual classroom. Makatutulong ito para sa mas maayos na pag-aaral ng mga bata. Kaya naman, narito pa ang additional tips mula kay Michelle Lazaro at Aiden. Panoorin po natin ito. Good morning, Kapung Lisa. Good morning, lovies. It's the part two of our virtual classroom etiquette. Classroom etiquette number seven. Please use a microphone and speakers. It's not polite to not use it so you can't hear the teacher and you can't recite. Yes, okay. So, it's the microphone is very important so the teacher and also your classmates can hear you clearly. And also, uh, speakers, so it's the other way around, so you can hear clearly what the teacher and some of your classmates are saying. Virtual classroom etiquette number eight. Do not interrupt when someone is talking. It's bad because when you interrupt, you can still have your turn and that won't be nice. Alright? So, virtual classroom etiquette number 9. You have to dress appropriately. I don't know with other schools, but Aiden uh, is required to wear uh, either a polo shirt like this with collar or a round black shirt. Okay? If it's not a school uniform, then it has to be something decent. Like something that is showing respect also to the other people you are talking to in front of your computer. Number 10. No screenshots and no video recording of the virtual class session. So you can take a picture or screenshot a person that had a funny face or a teacher or a classmate or if they do something inappropriate and so when you record the teacher can already record what's happening yeah and i think um this virtual class uh thing it's still a property of the school right so you cannot just record or take pictures without asking permission first Virtual classroom etiquette number 11. Do not use inappropriate background. So it can either be a real background like this. We're using our favorite, one of our favorite um, portraits. I think there are some apps also that allow you to choose from different templates. Like if you don't, if you want to use virtual background also, if it's allowed by your teacher. Okay, virtual etiquette number 12. Only registered participants, meaning the students and the teachers, are allowed to enter the virtual classroom. Why? Because if parents join, we cannot share the code because it's on your class. So even if you're the mommy or you're the daddy, as the teacher asks, you to join the class for whatever reason then you cannot okay only the students and the teachers must be there okay virtual etiquette number 13 the last in our list find a quiet corner in your house um, and make this your study area okay it, it's also important that it's uh, there's a good lighting and a stable internet connection. <laughs> so, wake up, baby. <laughs> so, if it's loud, you won't Let's... hear or decide. So, if you have headphones and it's still loud, then that won't work. Okay. So, you need to find a quiet spot. And you might disconnect from the Wi-Fi. So, that's bad. Then, my study room, we have light. So, it's Why is easy. important? Why is it so important to have proper lighting? So, can see you properly. Correct. It can be uh, quite challenging for some. I know there are students sharing space with other people, with his or her siblings. Ask for the help of your mommy and daddy to find you that it doesn't have to be a big space. 
and if better if you can also find and this will save your you electricity if you can find um a space with natural source of light like put your table or computer where there is a window so you can benefit from the natural light coming in okay and the most challenging i think for all of us okay even us we're having problems with that sometimes is the internet connection okay there are really they call it dead spots like there are some spots in your place where you really cannot connect okay to your wi-fi to your internet you know you don't want to be reciting and then your internet gets disconnected so it for today guys i hope you enjoy your day and we will see you again meantime please please watch all programs and shows of net 25 okay so bye guys bye Thanks for ayan thank you kay aiden at kay miss Shelly Lazaro sa kanilang mga additional tips para sa mga nag-school from home. Mga kapabansa, maray pa po kaming ihahatid sa inyo sa pagbalik ng pambansa ang almusal!